Hey everyone, today I want to share some of my favorite apps that can serve as your Live OS. A Live OS is like your personal operating system, uh, a single tool that helps you capture ideas, manage commitments, and apply your time without constantly switching different apps. So let's dive in. Okay, let's start with Lunatask, which has quickly become one of my favorite all-in-one tools. What makes it different is how it combines several tools that you'd normally need separate apps for, a task manager, notes, a habit tracker, journal, and even a relationship manager. I really like this unique, combination. The, the task manager is clean and intuitive, but it's so much more than that. You can create multiple areas of your life, like personal, uh, work, and family. And for each one, you can set goals with deadlines, such as learn piano or uh, build a website. And uh, what's interesting is how flexible it is with different task management methods. There is a, a priority list, which I think is the, uh, the most common way of organizing your tasks. But also, um, now or later, Kanban, Eisenhower Matrix, and so on. Um, it's very nice to have this flexibility so you can find the, the best workflow for you. I also like that it has this daily calendar in the sidebar where you can just drag and drop to schedule your to-dos, as well as uh, this scratch pad to jot down anything. And for writing, you can make notes and organize them with tags. Um, it doesn't have advanced features like tables and bi-directional linking, but it's probably enough for most people. And then there's this habit tracker to keep track of your habits and uh, journal as well to keep a record of your day. I also love that it's got this relationship tracker where you can keep track of various people in your life. It's uh, kind of helpful to have a personal CIM like this as you get to know more people because it's very easy to forget to catch up with them or remember what they like. Okay, the second one is by design. It's a relatively new app and it's probably my most favorite one on this list. So I'm really happy they're sponsoring this video today. I really like this tool because of its simplicity and how well it combines notes, to-dos and calendar. So the first thing I like is how it makes task management and planning feel natural and enjoyable rather than like a chore. The home screen gives you a clear overview of your day, showing your tasks, calendar events, and habits all in one view. I really appreciate it shows your summer day tasks as well, because I always forget about them otherwise. Also, another small detail I like is the progress bar. You can see how much you've completed your task list for today. It's just kind of motivating to finish all my tasks. And one thing I particularly love is how it handles note-taking alongside task management. You can attach files, create checklists, and even build simple databases, making it great for both quick notes and more structured project planning. It also lets you organize your documents by folders and tags, so it won't be messy. And after you make your to-dos, you can drag and drop them to your calendar to schedule them. Um, I appreciate it has various calendar modes from one day view to weekly and to monthly. And also another thing that I love is being able to set task details using natural language. So just type something like submit report on Friday at 3 p.m. and it automatically set the due dates and time. This makes creating new tasks so much faster and more intuitive. And also they are adding new AI features as well. One is AI powered goal planning. You simply type a goal you want to achieve and then their AI crafts a step-by-step -step plan. What's really cool is that you automatically adjust if you miss a task task, which keeps your plan realistic and achievable. And best of all, it's surprisingly affordable at just $4 a month if you pay annually or $6 monthly. This pricing makes it one of the best value in this area. So you can download it right now to check it out uh, from the link in the description, or you can scan this QR code on the screen. All right, next up is Craft, which I think is the best Notion alternative. It's such a beautifully designed productivity app. You can create documents with different styles and even customize the font for each page. Um, for task management, you can add to-dos to your inbox or create them inside a document and add a deadline as well as reminders. And then there's this calendar where you can drag and drop to build your schedule. It's simple, but it's just, just enough to get things organized. And one feature that sets it apart is its AI assistant with local LLM. Unlike cloud-based AI tools, Craft can run AI features directly on your devices, which means you can get AI help organizing your document, generating task lists, and so on without uploading your information to external servers. So if you like the simplicity of Apple Notes and uh, Apple Reminders, but one more power and flexibility, Craft is a great choice. Now, moving on to to 
Twos, which is another fantastic free option if you like simple note apps like Google Keep. Twos might look kind of basic at first, but you'd be surprised how much it's got to offer. The core of Twos is the daily note where you can just type in whatever's on your mind, whether it's a memo, a task you need to do, or event you want to remember. It's super simple to use, which I love because you don't have to think about where to put things. If you're working on bigger projects, more complicated things, Twos lets you create lists that work like project notes. You can start writing or collecting everything you need for the project in one place. There is also a calendar where it shows your schedule with to-dos and events. And one of the neat features is this AI integration. You can use it to explain things, break down tasks, correct grammar, or really anything you want. And it even analyzes your tasks and gives you smart suggestions. Um, so for example, if I have a to-do to get a gift for my dad, it automatically suggests gift ideas for dad, uh, which is super neat. Also, now they have this AI chat uh, where you can chat with your notes. Um, it's helpful when you want to summarize your notes or get specific information from them. Um, anyway, um, what amazes me is that this is free. Uh, this is the kind of quality that you'd normally expect to pay for. Um, the amount of features you get without spending a dime is pretty incredible. But at the same time, it can be difficult to learn how it works and how to use it because it's very unique and different from other apps or you know other task apps and note apps. And also it's insanely customizable, which is great, but also it can be just overwhelming and, and confusing. Um, so give it a try and uh, see for yourself. Okay, so next one is very different from the others on the list. MeBot, which is like ChatGPT that can also manage your to-dos and notes for you. You can tell MeBot anything, your, your thoughts, ideas, plans, and uh, things you need to do, and you automatically detects the type of your input. So if it's a, a journal entry, it labels as moments in life or thought. And if it's a task, it turns into a to-do. The task manager is kind of simple, um, but you can set the starting date and the reminders as well, and you can attach notes too. And for each task you create, even offers help to accomplish them, like suggesting restaurants when you have a task to, to plan a dinner. The note-taking experience is great in general because of its ability to analyze and connect your notes. When you save something, it automatically finds patterns and links between your ideas. Um, you can even ask questions about your notes later and it will give you a summary of relevant entries. And MeBot can also organize your notes by topics such as tech, health, and photography, even detects important people in your life and creates folders for them. Okay, finally, let's talk about Timestripe, which takes um, such an interesting approach to life management. Instead of focusing on daily tasks, Timestripe is built around the concept of a time horizons, which is great for you to see and plan your life across different time scales from daily tasks all the way up to life goals. I love this timeline view. Unlike the other apps, it lets you visualize your entire life plan on a timeline. And for each area of your life or project, you can make different boards. There's templates for almost everything, so you don't have to start from scratch. It's good not just for task management, but also for keeping your notes as well. I think it might take a while to get used to how it works, but when it comes to kind of like a strategic life planning, this is one of the best for sure. It's perfect for anyone who wants to um, take a more intentional, long-term approach to organizing their life rather than just managing day-to-day -day tasks. Okay, thank you so much for watching till the end. That's it for today. Um, I will see you in the next video. Bye.